Hello and welcome to my channel. I'm King Posh and today we're looking at my rear wheel drive drift to our 20 F type S V R. Here is my sure code. Got it? Great. And I'm the only A class uh, so far here. Uh, all I did was put any drift any and just press search and you're going to find me. All right, or you can just use my share code. But as I can see from everybody else, nobody has an A-class except me. So, I have the best rear-wheel drive A-class Jaguar. Let's get into the build and the tune. And then we'll take her outside. And, of course, I did paint the car myself. And I am not a painter. But I made it, you know, I made it work. It's got 700 horsepower with the stock engine. Rear wheel drive drivetrain. All right. Stock front bumper. Stock rear spoiler wing. Got snow tire compound. Stock width in the front. Stock width in the rear. We are using a heavier rim so I can get all that extra power in this vehicle. We've got 20 inch rims in the front and 21 inch rims in the rear. Just stock track width in the front and the sec the first one over uh, rear track width in the rear. Everything to keep it in the A class range. Messing with anything else would go up. All right, we got a 10 speed transmission, stock driveline, and a drift differential. We got stock brakes, drift springs and dampeners, no anti roll bars for the front, nor in the rear, all stock, no roll cage, and no uh, weight reduction. Now let's look at the power. Stock intake, race fuel system, stock ignition, sports cam and valves, stock valves, sport engine block, stock pistons, stock supercharger, race intercooler, and a race oil and cooling, and then a stock flywheel. Car mastery, as you can see what, what's all there. And then let's look at the tune and show you guys what I did to this thing. So you got 55, 55 to maximize that slide. All right, here is my gearing that I've come up with and you guys will get to see what this is like when I take her outside. Here is my alignment that I decided to use for this vehicle, and it works very, very well. It is super smooth. No anti roll bars to worry about. Springs are on the very, very stiff side, so I can just, you know, get this thing to really slide. Lows you can go is four in the front, five in the rear. Dampening is 20, 20, one and one. No downforce, no brakes. Differential is 21%. Acceleration and 100% deceleration. Okay, let's take her outside and show you guys what she's like. And of course, I did paint this thing myself, as you can pretty much tell by the uh, the hood. It's hilarious. I uh, also painted the sides here. And uh, the uh, antenna in the back, I painted that. and yeah, It looks good. Either way. Very subtle. I love this thing. I had to show it to you guys. So usually I show a whole lot of all-wheel drive drift tunes and not a lot of real-wheel drives, but this thing is pretty smooth. That's 700 horsepower. It's, it's plenty. It gets the job done.
Now the high I've hit on this with this car is a 38, but I don't know what I'll hit here. Oh, there, there's a 40. Sweet. 40,000 points right there. Beautiful. So, I did 2,000 better than I did when I was tuning this car. Super, super smooth. I think Gay's going to really enjoy this tune. And there you have it. There's my real wheel drive drift tune for the SVR. Well, hey guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely hit that like button. And I'll catch you guys next time. Stay sideways, my friends.